Good evening. Thank you for clicking the link. Episode number two of Color Me Crypto. It is Cinco de Mayo. Happy Cinco de Mayo. Shout outs to the Mexicans who in 1862 beat the French at the Battle of Puebla. Much respect. Anywho, back to the video. I decided to label this episode literally free money. And I hate to say it because nothing in life is free. But that's not the case tonight because it is literally free money. Before we dive in, I want to shout out some people who've uh, supported the channel so far. First, I want to shout out Brianna from my last ship, my last command. She gave me a lot of help on the first episode. So much shout out to her, aka Jamaica. Shout out to Nisha. She put a lot of faith in me in setting up a wallet for her, setting up her cryptocurrency wallet so i appreciate that uh vote of confidence and last but not least shout out my first two patreon supporters caleb he knows who he is and stinky butt she knows who she is but much love to those people i really appreciate it and that's not to say there aren't others who've been supporting the movement but those ones I got to make sure to acknowledge in this video. Let's hop right in. As usual, my contact information, adamantineblade at protonmail.com, the Discord server. All links you see in this video will be in the description. Make sure you visit that. And of course, if you like the content, do make a donation. It's much appreciated and it goes towards the creation of more content, high quality content, really good information much love let's hop right into the video this video is for informational purposes only nothing presented herein constitutes financial advice no person or entity associated with this production received payment or anything of value or entered into any agreement in connection with the depiction of software products services or trading platforms all views expressed are solely those of the channel unless explicitly stated otherwise Viewers should seek counsel from a financial advisor prior to making any investments. Investing without proper planning or research can result in a complete loss of funds. First things first, the lower the risk, the lower the reward, the higher the stakes, the bigger the payout. We will not be investing any money in this video today. Therefore, these steps are considered low risk. Please be patient, you will get some cryptocurrency. The purpose of this video is solely to help you get your feet wet, help you get your hands on a few coins without having to spend any of your hard-earned fiat. No money is required to follow along. Again, just time and effort. All in all, if you follow the steps, it should take you about one to two hours, probably less depending how tech savvy you are. And that's not including the wait time for the KYC checks to be approved or denied. And lastly, pause this video go at your own pace, have fun, and all links can be found in the description. Thank you for watching. Before we jump right in and get started, let's take a look at what is actually getting accomplished. First, we're going to install the Brave Browser. Brave Browser was designed to protect its users from targeted advertisements. It's a privacy-oriented browser. It actually comes with Tor capabilities included, those of you who know what Tor is. And it's all around just a fun browsing experience that rewards you with cryptocurrency to use their platform. Second, we're going to set it as our default browser. Third, we're going to use Brave to create a Coinbase account. After that, we're going to use Coinbase Earn. Coinbase Earn is actually a pretty cool, um, I guess, business model that is on Coinbase where they actually pay users to learn about cryptocurrency. So you'll watch short little videos. Each clip is about maybe a minute, two minutes long, and they actually reward you with cryptocurrency just for watching the video and answering a question like a kind of like a knowledge test at the end of the video. Lastly, we're going to create a Nexo account and then we're going to transfer the money that we got from Coinbase Earn into the Nexo account. So Nexo is basically another exchange. However, unlike Coinbase, Nexo pays interest 
once you're using their platform to store your cryptocurrency. So we're going to use Coinbase Earn to get coins for free because it is literally free money. Although I hate to say it because there's no such thing as a free thing, but we're going to use Coinbase Earn to get free coins. Then we're going to create a Nexo account and then we're going to take those free coins from Coinbase and transfer them into Nexo where they will earn interest over time. So even if the value of that coin goes up or down, we're still earning interest via Nexo. So I hope that makes sense. Let's get started. So this video is going to be really straight to the point. I'm not going into any technical stuff. For the most part, we're really just going to talk about how you get this free money. So on the screen, we got the basic attention token and you can get this for free by installing the Brave browser, the Brave Internet browser. You go to Brave.com. The logo for the browser is a lion, an orange lion. Excuse me. So you install Brave browser onto your machine. You set it up and then you start earning basic attention token just by browsing the Internet. So if you're someone like me who's on the computer a lot and, you know, you're just browsing, Googling, whatever, you can actually get paid by using Brave Browser to get basic attention token. And right now, one basic attention token is worth more than a dollar or I should say it's selling for more than a dollar. I believe it's a dollar twenty three, a dollar twenty five. So if you install the Brave Browser, you will literally get paid just for browsing. And I tested this myself because I recently reinstalled it on this machine. After only about a half hour of browsing online, this is only in one night, by the way. After only about a half hour, I earned about seven cents. That's seven cents more than if I was using any other browser. So just keep that in mind. So we're going to install Brave Browser first and foremost. So like I said, first things first, you visit httpsbrave.com. Make sure your connection is encrypted. In order to do that, you just scroll up into the URL bar where you typed in Brave and you make sure that there's a little lock icon. You can click on that lock and when you click on it, it should read something saying connection is secure or something along those lines. So now here's a screenshot from my web browser. So you're pretty much just going to click that orange button when you visit the website. You're going to download Brave. You're going to run that exe file. And I'm assuming that you're on Windows. I've tailored this video mainly for Windows users only because I know Windows is the most popular operating system. But if you're on a different operating system, this will still work for you. You can still download the Brave browser. Also, if you're on a phone or you want to put it on a cell phone, you can do that. But I will tell you, if you're on a cell phone, you will not really earn much of anything because cell phones use less data. Therefore, Brave is going to block less ads and they're going to deliver less ads. So you're not going to earn as much if you use Brave browser on a cell phone. So just keep that in mind. I targeted this video mainly for people who are running Windows machines. So install Brave Browser, make sure you open it up, set up your crypto wallet. It's one of the extensions. If you click on the extension icon, which is at the top of your screen, it looks like a little puzzle piece on the right hand corner. Once you get it installed, you're going to click on that, set up your crypto wallet and you're good to go. So now you have to set it as your default browser. So anytime you want to use the Internet, 
the first thing your computer is going to look to open is a brave browser so you're just going to hit your windows key go to settings and then from settings you're going to hit apps after you hit apps you're going to click on default apps so underneath default apps you're going to scroll down what you're going to look for is web browser you're going to click it you might have google chrome you might have microsoft edge or whatever you're going to click it underneath choose an app you should see an orange lion that is the brave browser icon you're going to click that set your default browser to brave and that's it first step is complete every time you use the internet now you're going to open up brave browser and you're going to automatically be earning basic attention token over time they pay you monthly so i believe it's on the first of every month either the first or the fifth or around that time you're going to get your payout so the more you use the internet the more you earn and that's better than any other web browser no other web browser pays you just to browse the internet so now step number two wants you to close whatever web browser you were using to install brave and open up brave now that it's installed as your default web browsing app and you want to visit that link coinbase.com slash join richard underscore svi that is my personal referral link it will reward you with ten dollars on your first purchase of one hundred dollars or more in cryptocurrency on that website so you want to make sure you have a driver's license and a cell phone handy. Make sure that cell phone has a camera on it. You're going to be taking two pictures of your driver's license, one of the front and one of the back. It's a very straightforward process and it's very quick. There are the pros of Coinbase. There are the cons. The main con for me, honestly, with Coinbase is their fees. Their fees are very high. But seeing as how we're not putting down any money in this video, the fees are pretty much a non-factor because we're going to be spending the money that coinbase gives us so it's very straightforward you want to sign up for your account fill in your name your address all of that good stuff i believe it also acts for your social and then you're going to verify your email address that's step one so sign up for the account and then verify your email so now that your account's created and you verified your email address what you need to do is confirm your identity the easiest way, like I said, is use a driver's license. You want to have your cell phone. What Coinbase will do, they will send a link to your mobile phone. And from that link, you can take pictures of your driver's license. Just take a front picture, take a back picture, and then you just upload it to their website. It is very quick. It only took about, I want to say, two minutes for mine to go through and get verified. So my driver's license was verified very fast. And on the left hand side of the screen, you see level one, level two, level three. Your account starts off at level one. For the purpose of this video, I think level two is fine, but you might as well get your account to level three because once you're at level three, all the restrictions have been pulled off of your account. So you want to get your identity verified. Make sure you use a driver's license. That's the easiest way. So now this is why we made the account Coinbase Earn. After this slide, I'm going to show you how to get to Coinbase Earn. You want to make sure you verify your account. Verify, verify, verify. That will remove all the restrictions from your account. You will be able to buy, sell, send, receive. You will mainly be sending. You will not be buying or selling, just sending. So how it's going to work is you verify your account. You go to Coinbase Earn. Like I said, I will show you how to do that in the next slide and then you're gonna send it to your interest account which we're gonna create after this so now we're assuming you've created your account you verified it the verification will only take about one two i want to say verification will only take three to five minutes and that's taking the picture with your cell phone they recommend using your cell phone so just use your cell phone front and back of your driver's license verification is done then you add a payment method you just hook up the account to your bank so now you're gonna go here to for you so you click for you and it'll you know take you to this ready to buy your first whatever I'm, I don't want to buy any I want to get some so see here it says earn crypto learn new cipher earn three dollars in new if I scroll down some more it you know talks about um let's see here's another one 
learn the graph earn three dollars in grit scroll down some more what is DeFi? these are all just educational stuff earn fifty dollars in stellar and in, in xlm so now you go here on the side you see it says earn get free crypto in minutes while learning how it works so i'll click on compound lesson number one earn interest with compound this is maya she is a sophisticated crypto investor with assets on exchanges and in private wallets However, these assets are effectively idle because she's not earning interest on any of them. Her cash savings account. So basically you're going to go to your dashboard. You're going to. So if you try to type in earn, so let me just show you. If you try to type in coinbase.com slash earn, it's going to take you to coinbase.com slash rewards. That's not what you want. It used to be coinbase.com slash rewards uh, sorry slash earn but if you type that in yourself it's gonna just forward you to rewards and it's gonna ask you to invite people so you want to go to for you and then here you here's how you get to the coinbase.com slash earn you you don't type it into the the URL bar and then you just hit um you hit whichever coin you want to learn about and um, so you're on the wait list to start earning sooner you can verify your photo and identity so i already uploaded my uh, driver's license i guess they want a selfie as well so you would just you know take a selfie but basically when you're done with those uh video courses i'm not taking it if i'm not getting paid when you're done with those little video courses each little video is going to have a questionnaire and you just answer the question it's multiple choice you answer it and then it'll reward you like one dollar until you get you know the maximum so if it's three dollars there'll be like three questions one dollar each so that's how you do that so now again use that link it's gonna be in the description sign up for a nexo account you're gonna have to solve a puzzle to prove that you're a human all you have to do is take a little slider and drag a puzzle piece into place and then the last step you're gonna confirm your email address so now we're just about done we just want to complete the next KYC checks because much like coinbase your account is very limited until you verify your identity and prove that you are who you claim to be so you want to take your driver's license passport whatever take those pictures upload it to nexo and make sure you're good to go get all of those limitations pulled off of your account so now here is where we start to transfer from coinbase into nexo if you need to pause the video but it is very straightforward it is very simple i will break it down step by step using these still shots so on the left hand side of the screen i have the account tab circled with red and i have the top up circled with red You'll notice that there's a top up button for each coin listed on Nexo. This is a screenshot from the Nexo account tab. So you're going to see all of the coins listed. You're going to have all of your balances. When you click on the top up button, whichever one you click on, I clicked on the top up Bitcoin button. So on the right hand side of the screen, you'll notice it says top up Bitcoin. Send only Bitcoin to the deposit address. I blanked out the deposit address but in that tab there in that little bar you're gonna see some num letters and numbers it's gonna be a string an alphanumeric string that's gonna be your address notice I didn't say Bitcoin address if you want you can pick any coin that is listed on Nexo but I just chose Bitcoin because it's the one that most people are familiar with so you're gonna click top up you're gonna see top up whatever coin you pick and then it's gonna give you a long string of characters that's called your receiving address you're gonna click copy on that you'll notice that there's a copy button next to the QR button in that little space you're gonna click the copy button you can manually do it if you want you can highlight all the characters and then right click it and copy you're gonna copy that address and we're gonna place it into coinbase so now this is the most 
important step. It's the last but the very most important step because you cannot afford to make a mistake on this step. If you do, you could potentially lose all of the money that you worked so hard to get. Before we start, I want to say you're going to get a bunch of different coins on Coinbase using the Coinbase Earn method where you watch the videos and answer questions. You'll get a little $5 here, $6 here, 10 here, whatever, whatever have you. What you want to do before you start this step is you want to go on Coinbase and you want to convert all of those coins that you earned into a coin that you know is supported by Nexo. So what I mean by that is you're going to take all of those coins that you earned and turn them into one single coin. So for example, Coinbase Earn doesn't allow you to get Bitcoin by watching an instructional video. So what you could do is you could take all of the other coins that you got on Coinbase using those videos answering those questions. You could use Coinbase and you're going to swap them for Bitcoin. It's going to be a very small amount of Bitcoin, but it's going to be Bitcoin. Once you convert all of that, your balance is going to transfer over. Your portfolio is going to transfer over to 100 percent Bitcoin or whatever coin that you chose to convert to. It doesn't have to be Bitcoin. It could be any other coin as long as you can transfer it to Nexo. Log in to Nexo and see which coins are on Nexo and see which coins are on Coinbase that you can swap between. If I hope that makes sense. So once you pick that one coin that you want, you want to transfer it over to a single address. So I'll show you now really quick. This is very important. It's straightforward, but it's very important that you do not make a mistake. So on the left hand side of the screen, we have Coinbase. What you want to do is in the top right hand corner where it says buy, sell, send, receive. You want to click send, receive. And then you're going to get a pop up like what's on the right hand side of the screen in the middle is from Nexo where we took that address and we copied it. We're going to take that address that we copied from Nexo and we're going to paste it in the two line on Coinbase. So we're going to send X amount of Bitcoin or whatever coin. It doesn't necessarily have to be Bitcoin. We're going to send X amount of whatever coin to the address that we copy and paste it from Nexo. So you're going to paste it in there. You don't have to add a note. It's optional. And then you're going to select pay with. Make sure you pay with whatever coin you were using on Nexo or else it's not going to line up. It's not going to work. And then you just hit continue. You click through that and you're good to go. The reason I say you don't want to mess up is because if even one letter is off, that transaction will not go through. However, I believe that it's updated and they have a security feature where if the address is wrong, it'll give you a warning and it won't let you uh, send. But I haven't tested it. I'm I'm 90 percent sure it's not going to let you send if you have a wrong address in there. But you might put in a wrong address that still ends up being a legitimate address and it still lets you send the transaction. That's why I say. You want to copy and paste. You don't want to try to type it out by hand because, you know, it's subject to human error. Just copy it from Nexo and in the two line on Coinbase, after you click send and receive in the top right hand corner of your Coinbase account, you're going to just paste in the two line that address from your Nexo account and then you're going to credit it. You're going to top it up. It should take. Mm, I want to say. I want to say a half hour, maybe less to credit to your account. But once it's in there, you're earning interest and it pays out interest daily. So your interest gets credited daily. And I believe weekly it'll give you a statement on how much you earned. So that's how you do it. It's very straightforward. You create a Coinbase account. Well, let me rewind. You download Brave Browser. You get paid to use the Internet. You create a Coinbase account. You verify your Coinbase account. You use Coinbase Earn to get some free coins. Those free coins, you're gonna con sorry, you're gonna convert them into one single coin. Instead of having a hundred little pennies here and there, you're gonna convert all the coins you got from Coinbase Earn into one single digital token, and then you're gonna transfer that over to Nexo. 
and make sure that Nexo supports the coin you convert to. Just log into your Nexo account. Make sure that the coin you're choosing on Coinbase lines up to the coin you're choosing on Nexo. And then go from there. You'll be good. Add your money to Nexo. You're earning interest on it daily. It's very easy. It's very straightforward. And most importantly, it's free. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any questions, just leave a comment. Much love. Peace.